Good motivation, no stagnation. Round six. We call this uh, a bonus uh, mix. No, since I already did like a mile uh, on the uh, jogging, I wanted to finish it off with uh, on the bike because of my knees. My knees and my, uh, and my back. So that's what I wanted to do. I thought I just got finished doing a dumbbell press. So hey, fresh week on one, day one, on the exercise bike. So you see, my routine is finished. But I just wanted to give myself just another 15 minutes, not 10 minutes, 10, 15 minutes. Uh, ain't nothing wrong with that either. So you can treat yourself. That's it. on this beautiful Saturday. Uh, Saturday motivation though. And don't forget the sea salt, spring water. You know? Which is electrolyzing. Uh, it's been drizzling off and on. But last night it was like a, a straight thunderstorm. <laughs> but that's stagnate the motivation. Include self. You know, something better than nothing if you don't fill up to it, but at least do something. You know? Never knowing your motivation just kick in then. You finish your routine. Just because it's the weekend. You might be off. It ain't nothing wrong with relaxing, but you still can give yourself 15, 20 minutes, five minutes. You got 24 hours in a day. Why not treat yourself four of them hours or six of them hours? You know? If you give yourself eight hours on the job, you know, give yourself the same when it comes down to your health. So love your health like you love your work. Grandma. Get it. That's it. That's it. But I feel good this morning. I just said a little aching just like it's in my hips and my knees. You know? I'm going to see my doctor on, I think, Tuesday. So, get another x-ray on my hips. But I just know uh, it says the sciatic. You know, my, my, my disc five and six. They say they want to have a surgery on my back, but I ain't doing that, man. Even the doctors even said, and, and I'm going to say this to y'all too, it depends on what type of um, back injury that you have for yourself. If you need to get back surgery, get it. But if you don't need to get um, back surgery, man, don't get it. But you just don't know what can trigger it off once they go back there. So see what you can do for yourself first. And if you can't, you know, we got to live with it anyway. So, you just got to, you have to keep enduring, you know, what we can take. You know, my tolerance on pain is just, it's high. So, like, I can tolerate, but I can get um, stagged and irritated as well, too, because it's like, damn, I woke up, hey, what the? So, that will stag you out right there. know how I do it, get on here non-stop. As I said, I've been um, getting on here, but I just some, um, you know, recorded. You know, but I've been getting on here after I, I eat or something, or like I feel some stiffness in. Yeah. Cause honestly, I like to jog, but I don't, uh, doctor said I'm supposed to because of my knees. I don't have no cartilage, it's on bone on bone and but man, like I said these three years I've been healing myself, so I've been strengthening my age.
I tested my strength. I was trying to walk. I ain't gonna sit down. I was walking. And uh, I was like, ah, oh, my knees, my, my back, I just feel it. Right after the routine, I was like, oh. Uh, Y'all just see me when I'm um, just, you know, doing my routine. But after the routine over with, trust and believe, my brother be in his little issues and stuff. But you know, but I still keep a motive, you know, keep stay motivated with it. And don't really let the uh, the aches really take over me like that. So that's why I just wake up and just do what I do on the day. That's what I say, everyday therapy, 365. You know, I know my content might not be for everyone, but I know my content is for those who like myself. You know? Who taking their life back on their own hands and not relying on opioids to do it. Because I don't care what nobody say, man. You talk on opioids, 10, 15 minutes later, you right back down. Uh -huh. nah, I'm cool on that. Especially like them steroids. Them steroids do me all the way up. And I ain't talking about the steroids, you know, the uh, bodybuilders you use. Talking about that, um, it's not what I'm feeding. Predazone? Yeah, Predazone. I forgot it meant so long. Heard the bell just going so much at 10 30. I think I started at like 10 22. That's a good 10 minutes. That's all. Uh, I'm going to refuel my temple. Yeah. Get the day started. Well, it's already started because the brother blessed. And I woke up and did what I had to do. Uh, I might be in your city today. So, like I say, I got my favorite cities I've been in. So if you see me in your city, say, what's up, King Motor, baby? <laughs> yes, sir. Yeah. Try to think what we're going to do on vacation. Yep. So. Should be ten minutes though. Uh, I'd say like the same amount of time I gave myself uh, with the jaw. No. So hey. Oh no, that's only eight. But I don't want about to be nine, so let's say like another minute. But after the uh, cardio, man, make sure that you know you still get your little good stretches, whatever that you might need. You know, you'll do what you need to do for yourself to keep yourself active and motivated. Yes, sir. Two days left. So, hey, y'all stay. Y'all do what y'all need to do to 
keep yourself motivated. About the August, man. Let me let you know. I don't wait for no one. One time, stuff just seems like it's stagnant, and you're not doing nothing. The time still don't wait for that. So be motivated not to stand. Hey, don't stand yourself out. Uh, said two days left. Love self must love you back. Appreciate don't appreciate you. You know, I'm a guy. You know, I'm a sincere blessing. Yes. Uh, that's it. That's all I wanted to do. Stretch them legs for a minute. See if that helped my arm. My hip and my arm, my knees. You know? But if you're all here today, keep motivated. Love you. I'm out of here. Y'all stay healthy and motivated on this Saturday, on the Sabbath. So. See y'all tomorrow. Peace. Shalom. Uh. <laughs>